Jesus is the only one that hears your cries when you're alone in the night time. Jesus hears your silent prayers when there is not a word yet on your tongue. Jesus knows the reason why your heart so softly in the night is breaking. He sees each silent falling tear and in your sorrow he is near to guide you and to care for you. Like a shepherd leading all the flock he's feeding walking by the water still and slow. He leads me to green pastures by the living waters my cup is overflowing, he anoints me, he restores my soul. Jesus is the one you need, fill your empty heart with all it's aching. He's the one who created you, have a need that only he can fill. He sees each day and all the things do to keep your nagging so far away he says oh you who are burdened down heavy laden tired out come to me and find some rest today like a shepherd leading all the flock is feeding walking by the water still and slow he leads me to green pastures by the living waters my cup is overflowing, he anoints me, he restores my soul. Jesus is the Holy One, the Lamb slain before the world's foundation. Jesus is the only one who has the right to take your sins away. On your knees now, bowing down, call on Him and ask Him for salvation. Confess your sins, lay them down, lay your pride to the ground. Day and trust upon his name. Like a shepherd leading, all the flock he's feeding, walking by the water still and slow. He leads me to green pastures by the living waters. My cup is overflowing, he anoints me, he restores my soul. Like a shepherd leading, all the flock is feeding, walking by the water still and slow. He leads me to green pastures by the living waters. My cup is overflowing, he rejoins me, he restores my soul. Those words, um, that he restores my soul. And leads by the waters. That's from Psalm 23, and it's the psalm about how God is uh, our shepherd and how we shall not want. And if you want to know Jesus as your Savior, as your shepherd, click the link, or click in the description, rather, and we have the gospel message there, and it tells you why he came to this earth, why he came, so that he could suffer and die on a cruel cross. It was because of our sin. Our sin that makes it so that nobody can save themselves because we've all broken the Ten Commandments. Every one of us has told a lie, has stolen something, has done something that 
we shouldn't do and the god and in the bible it says that the punishment for that is death everlasting separation from god and it's it's real it's a real place hell is and the the truth is that god doesn't want that anybody would go there and it's as simple as calling out on a savior for salvation that's what i did that's what joe did that's what we all did we're not here because we're better than anybody we're all sinners uh i'm one of the worst if, if you knew what i was before i got saved and that's that's our testimony that it's god who changes lives so read that message read the gospel message find out why you need salvation and how you can have your salvation this very day thank you